Good morning. It's Saturday morning and I thought I would vlog for a couple of days. I don't really know. Maybe the weekend, maybe a little bit more. Um, but right now I just took a shower because I was feeling a little puppy and like gross. So started with a shower. And now I'm gonna go walk to Little Tart and get a matcha and maybe a little egg sandwich. We'll see. Let's go. This little outfit. I got these little black boxers from Shop Arc. They always send the cutest things. And um, yeah, that's just my um, just woke up, gonna walk to get matcha look. <laughs> Very specific look. Yeah. Yesterday I walked six miles and then ran six miles. So today, um, my inner thighs and stuff are and back are so sore. Also, this person's car window got broken. Oops. Also, August in, um, in Atlanta is usually like the hottest month, but right now it's so breezy and it feels so good. And yesterday it was like 74. I mean, it got up to like 80 something, but like still kind of crazy. Such a good breeze right now. I love it. Look at this egg sandwich. It is the best thing ever. Like, look at that egg. It's so soft and like steamed and mm, so good. Are you a baby? Look at that body. It's a really good body. Really chunky body. Ollie Cam. Look, Ollie, it's Ollie Cam. I don't know. She was at Rio's. Look at her teeth. We go to El Tesoro on Friday. I've had dry eyelids for like a couple months now and so if you see red patches on my eyes, that's why. Pretty cute. Me and this cute little marigold, I think that's what it is. Love a good flower. Also lately I just like don't really love the way I look. And maybe, you know, there's like a combination of things. And I feel like that kind of comes in waves. Like sometimes you're like, okay, this is me, love it. And then other times you're like, this is me. <laughs> um, and like your body and all that, like not liking that as much. So I'm kind of in that phase. So if you see me like looking a little, like I'm constantly adjusting myself, that's probably why. Cause I'm like, fuck, you know. So I'm just in a phase of that right now working on it for sure but yeah that's like a tough one for me because you know it comes in phases um but just wanted to you know say that because it's a normal thing i guess and if anyone else feels that way then you're not alone also i will say instagram and just the internet in general makes that 
so much worse. <laughs> like there are just things that like, you know, just the beauty standards that are basically impossible. And they really get to your head sometimes. So, you know, trying to let go of that because there's really no good reason to hold on to those because they're, yeah, no. There's a lot of problematic, you know, undertones to all that, you know, but uh, still hard. Put a little bit of makeup on to freshen up my face just to, you know, feel a little bit better. So well, my eyebrows look giant, actually. Okay, maybe I need to tone down, tone down the eyebrows. Except I didn't even put that much in them. Just a quick little bit check. I've never said that before, I don't know why I said it. Um, I might switch out the bag when I go to Reese's house because I'm about to head over there. I just couldn't find the right one, but here's the look. See you in a bit. Hi, Rudy Booty. Hi, Reese. Huh? Hi. Hi. How are you? Pretty good. How are you? Oh, you know, not much. Just Saturday things. Dates. So did Reese. I don't know if that's still like you're allowed to buy Yeah, true. Let's maybe not. <laughs> that is crazy large. So I just got back home. I went to Bella Cucina. They have the best homeware and like pantry items and furniture and like oh it's just so beautiful. I got some dates and then I stopped by my friend Cheetah's studio that she just got um, that she's sharing with a friend. Um, they just do like paintings and stuff but they're beautiful but the studio is amazing so I just stopped by to say hi and now I'm back home and I'm probably gonna make some dinner soon. Maybe have like a little glass of wine. We'll see. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna make. I don't really have much food but so it'll be like um a random dinner so we'll see this is just a reflection from the floor and it looks terrible <laughs> looks like evil lighting like very dramatic i'm making some zucchini pasta i'm just gonna get it really soft and like creamy and delicious so. Shall be good. Oh, and I'm using bonza pasta. I love bonza pasta. You get more fiber and protein. It's not the same as, you know, normal pasta, but I do love it. I'm making some oatmeal. My newest obsession is oatmeal. I used to hate it. 
I'm sure you've seen me make oatmeal multiple times on this channel, but for some reason I could never get past the um, texture being so like gloppy. But recently, I can't stop. It's just so good. And like it's like an affordable, quick breakfast, you know? So, yeah. I always just top it with a lot of fruit and it's just like a very well-balanced breakfast. So that's what I'm making right now. And then I think I might go to the farmer's market to grab a few things. And we'll see. Sorry, the lighting in that last clip was horrendous, but um, yeah, I really want some chanterelle mushrooms. And there's um, a mushroom like um, business <laughs> company um, that sells at the market called Southern Cap Mushrooms, and they just harvested some chanterelles. So I definitely want some of those. I love mushrooms so much. And uh, I don't know what else I need. Maybe some kale. <laughs> we'll see. But oatmeal oh, first. I always put in half of a banana and a shit ton of cinnamon. Um, soft cooked banana is truly, that sounds really gross, but it's truly so good. It's my um, obsession now, but. So if you haven't tried that, you should, because it's delicious. It's like a dessert. This does not look flattering at all, but it's, it's really good, I promise. fruit I mean loaded up with fruit <laughs> soft banana, I tell you, is like the best thing ever. Mm -hmm. To the market we go. I'm a little late going, so we'll see if they have any good things left. They are so yummy. Some little um, fairy tale eggplants, I think that's what it's called. Or fairy eggplants, not fairy tale. <laughs> um, little flowers and some arugula. Because I like, kind of showed up late, there wasn't that many things, but there's this really yummy cashew cheese there that I really wanted to get, but I don't think they have left because they maybe ran out, but it's really yummy. I forget what the um, company's called, but it's like local here. It's so yummy. The like pesto one is mm, 
Sundays are always my favorite day to clean up, so I'm gonna clean up in here and like make my bed and all that stuff. Just give it a nice refresh for the new week, so I'm gonna put on some good music and do that. such cute little like shape and color. It's a little dark in here now, but everything is pretty much cleaned up. Nothing on the counter. Put these in the vase. Yeah. I'm gonna cook up some chanterelle mushrooms and some yellow squash arugula and some egg, I think. I'll show you how I do it. It'll be random, but I think it'll be good. some chanterelles, squash, eggs, and arugula, and it looks delicious. I don't know what this is, but my mom handed it to me, so I'm going to try it. They're like frozen raspberries with white and dark chocolate, which I don't love white chocolate, but I'm going to try it. I always have to eat something sweet after I eat something salty. It's just the way it is. And I'll never stop being that way. But why would I want to? Let's see. A little chocolate raspberry. Oh. It says, for best experience in flavor, remove product from pouch and thaw for 15 minutes. But like, no thank you. I would rather just eat it right now. It's really good. I love raspberry and chocolate. And now my kitchen's dirty again. I feel like all I ever do is clean the kitchen, mess up the kitchen, clean the kitchen, mess up the kitchen all day long. But I guess if you have a dishwasher, it doesn't feel that way as much, but I feel like that's probably a common feeling. If you're cooking most of your meals, it's just a constant thing. But really um, not necessary complaint, just pointing it out. <laughs> Right now, I'm going to go take a picture with Reese in the outfit that I wore yesterday. Because I, I was supposed to take a picture today, and then I just didn't have time. Um, and then we're going to go to do a yoga class with my friend Eve, who just got her yoga certification, like teacher certification. So this will be her first class that she's teaching on her own. So I'm very excited to do that. I haven't done yoga in a really long time, but my whole body's really sore from my run walk situation the other day so i definitely need some stretching so that'll be great and then i think we're gonna go to dinner afterwards and yeah i think that's it for today but i will film what i can 
Also, sorry that every time I film, I'm constantly just like adjusting and touching my face. That's so annoying, but this is what I do. I'm on our way to do some yoga. Are you excited to stretch, Reese? Oh, look at your arm. It looks jacked in this lighting. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna go do some yoga that we haven't done in a long time, but I'm excited. Yeah.